I was assigned to Vancouver uh, when I was in the Army. And then I moved on and started working for the city of Vancouver. You couldn't ask for a better place to be. It's just a wonderful location to raise a family and to work. When I retired from the Navy, the wife and I searched all over for the ultimate place to retire from the Navy. We drove all over the United States and ended up right back here. And we love it here. It's just an incredible place. It's a very giving community. A lot of uh, military had moved in the area, like me. I could stand here and give accolades about how the people are and everything for, for hours. It was just such a friendly atmosphere. They care about one another, they're involved in the community. And it's the most veteran-friendly place I've ever been. They care about their kids, they care about education, and they care about quality of life. Vancouver would be an incredibly good place to bring the children to the schools. Evergreen, for one, is one of the best school systems that I've ever dealt with. The other ones, you know, fall right in line with that. They're really good. And we have a large community college, which is rated one of the tops in the country. Those are really fine attractions to bring folks in here. They're looking to uh, get a quality education for their kids. The school systems are incredible. Obviously, Portland's a large metropolitan area. About 60,000 folks that commute uh, from Vancouver and Clark County into Portland because of the job opportunities. Washington State, of course, we have no income tax. And in Oregon, they have no sales tax. So we're right on the river and we can do both. So there's a lot of opportunities for folks to live in Vancouver and to work in Portland. You know, you have the best of both worlds here. Fort Vancouver is a fort that's a historical site. The Army was there for over 162 years. The fort itself is one attraction, but the Officers Row and Pearson Air Museum are all down there. Those are other attractions that are interesting. It's just a nice opportunity for us to have history right in the middle of downtown. It's the oldest town square in the state of Washington and a center of activity. That park every weekend is book solid. They have events down at Esther Short Park, like the movies in the evenings they have there, and you get to take your family down and you sit on the grass and watch a movie. A park where families can come together, have a good time, and enjoy one another and enjoy the summer. There's so many activities and so many things to do. This is the best place in the country to live. Yeah, I would recommend Vancouver to my family, friends, or anybody. I've lived in about 20 different other communities. They don't top Vancouver or this whole region. It's just an incredible place to live.